The Society of Women Engineers is an organization to support women in engineering and promote math and science for K through 12 to get specifically girls interested in engineering. I started uh, my first experience with computer engineering in my senior year. My girlfriend found out there was a computer math class and she wouldn't sign up by herself because she knew it would be all boys. So she dragged me down to the uh, principal's office and made me sign up and that got me started in computer science and I found out I was really good at it so I immediately changed my major in college and I ended up with a computer science degree. I have an exciting job at Agilent so it's fun to go to work. Um, I do put my family first and I make sure that everything in the family is taken care of before I jaunt off on something else and my volunteer work is to get more girls interested in the path that I took. And I try to take everything one day at a time. I don't look too far down the road because my schedule is somewhat overwhelming. So I just look at what am I doing this week and how can I get through this and balance everything. I admire my friends and my family and my parents because they all do so much for their communities. And I think I learned about volunteerism at home because my mom was also a Girl Scout leader and she worked um, avidly for the PTO, which I also did when my kids were in elementary. My philosophy about giving back to my community is that I'm trying to set an example and bring a presence to K through 12 girls and make sure that they know that they have all the options. They can be an engineer if they want to be an engineer. In the future, I'm looking forward to really soon my 20th anniversary with my husband, and that'll be fun. And my daughter is um, playing on volleyball at Air Academy High School, and she's also an honor student. And I enjoy participating and watching her. And I'm nearing the end of my career at Agilent. I don't want to say how close that is because, you know, you never know in my, in my business but I'm really looking forward to maybe getting some time to be at home and be an at-home mom before my daughter leaves for college. My best advice for a young woman about her path um, when she picks her career is to pick something you enjoy doing, something that excites you. Also, if you're smart, um, be as smart as you can be and don't let anyone take that away from you.